Wherever a man goes to, his bad character goes with him. This is what KBAC is telling Ashley. That ever since Ashley gave birth to the double crown prince, according to her, that her character has become worst by the day. That is what Oni say. That it does not understand Ashley again. If you talk to Ashley now, she's talking about crown prince. Ashley cannot reason anything. Her mind all is crown prince. From Monday to night, crown prince. Auntie Kilo Shelo, go, go, go. Who crown prince you? Hmm. <laughs> Ashley told KBAC that before she will come to the palace, that everybody have to leave the palace for her spiritual mother to come and dwell in the palace for 24 hours before she comes. <laughs> is this playing? Yes, now. Nah. Is this what? Is this playing? Spiritual mother, no. Spiritual father, call. What is this? <laughs> so right now, KBAC is saying that to her, Rita and her princess. So... The whole 800 people in the palace should leave palace with her. How is she thinking? Is it that she does not think well again? Or something have eaten her brain? Oni needs to understand. Because why? Oni is living his life to his fullest right now. Now that him and Naomi have, have cooperated, that is it. Yes. They say the greatest love anyone has is the one that Jesus has laid down their life. That is why I say that Oni and Naomi, they are on the same parastatus. He and Naomi, they are moving on the same lane. Because why? He and Naomi, they understand each other. They understand the principle of love. They understand the principle of you follow me, I follow you. But Ashley just feel ever since she gave birth to this Peking, that she is the owner of the kingdom. That's what Ashley is thinking. Yes. When a woman don't know her place, you don't know your place, Ashley. Hey, 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 it's not a smart thing, though. It's not a smart thing. If you don't know your place, you will overshoot your boundary. Yes. Naomi knows her what, and Naomi have self what. Ashley, you cannot force anybody to respect you. Respect is reciprocal. You have to respect them for them to respect you. So, you want to bring the woman to the palace so that the woman will come and wash palace. So that when you come, you'll be the one that your, your yes will be your yes and your no will be your no. And KBAC should even leave the palace for you. Like, who are you in the scheme of things? Who is she? Oh, this sea finish is becoming too much for KBAC. This is a serious matter of sea finish. If not, if not, oh. But anyway, only have one doubt. Only said that thing she likes saying. That let her not ever in her life say it again. Ashley says she's going to say it though because she should have the crown prince that she just feel some people have entered Oni here. Those people don't want Oni to see the truth. That's what Ashley is saying. That they don't want Oni to, 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 to see the truth. That she, she is the truth. She is the light. How are you the truth? How are you the light? You live in London but you are not exposed. You live in a foreign land but you are doing like somebody that is very, very local. That Oni should go and change the authenticity of what she is saying. That before she will come to the palace with the double crown prince because she is a princess and Kabiesi is a prince. So they have to, oh my God. Oh my God. At a point, Kabiesi just told her, will you just keep quiet? Is it that sense is very, very far from you? I'm telling you something. You are telling me about double crown, crown prince. Can you just respect yourself and find somewhere and sit down? I am the king of my palace and nobody... Kabiesi said nobody, he mean nobody is leaving this palace for anybody. They say he will finance the wife, finance good things and obtain that favor from the Lord. But ever since Kabiesi married this woman, no any good thing has his found. So, so trouble, so, so wahala. So, so trouble. Ashley told Oni that, yes, it's because you've not seen me now. It's because I have not come to the palace. You have been following the wrong set of women. I am the one that is coming to reset the palace. All those women, they've done a lot of things in the palace you are not seeing. I am the Calabash carrier. I'm the one seeing all the plotting, all the things these women have done in the palace. So you, calm down. Let me settle the things in the spirit. Or more, they say that is one that annoys KBSU. So you are the one that wants to come and settle the things in my own palace. In your, in, in your capacity as who? Setua. Judge. Judge of the jungle. <laughs> my brothers, my sister, is always what you do. It's not a small thing, no. Oni told her that she's biting more than she can chew. Just because she's from the ruling house does not mean anything she said that he will accept it. He's just looking at her because he has respect. 
He has respect for delegated authority. He has a, a respect for elders. And that is why he's keeping quiet for her. If not, by now, he would have thrown her away. Yes. But he's still looking at her like, oh, he has respect. But since she, she cannot have respect for herself, let all of them do what they want to do. Yes. Let them do what they want to do. Because Oni cannot continue like this. Yes. He cannot continue like this. They say where a man goes to dwell, his character go with him. When you say, I thought now that you have the prime prince, your character will change. Oh, that means Ashley have this character since. That's what Catholic is trying to say. Ashley, we are having a bad character since you gave Pekin. Are you the first person that gave birth to Pekin? Oh, only told them, I'm warning you, I'm warning you, don't overstep your boundary. If you overstep it, what I will do to you, eh? You will not understand. Even the difficult moment will be hard for you. Stay aside. And anything you are doing, those your women you used to bring to the palace, tell them not to come to this palace again. No. If not, you will not enter this palace with your double crown. Kolo, kolo, kolo. Ha! They said that one pain now. Ashley started crying. Ashley said throughout this year, she have not cried. That Kabi is making her cry. That ever since she gave birth, it's also cry, cry, cry. Whether Kabi is like it or not. That she's coming to that palace before she comes, they must do that work. Except Kabi Esi does not want her to come. Kabi Esi told her, Please don't come, remain where you are. Auntie, don't come, remain where you are. I am tired of you. I'm tired of your people. I'm tired of your business. I'm tired of everything you're doing, and that is on period. Hmm. She said, It's the devil. There is the enemy that see that she, she wants to come and beautify the, the palace. They are the ones that are causing confusion between she and Kabi Esi. But they should know that their time is up. Their what? Their time is up. Because she, as she is like this, she has come to overtake. And overtaking is allowed. That since the first, the second, and the third wife, they cannot do their business in that palace. That she, Olori, Ashley, she will come to that palace. She will do her business. And she will move gradually out. And nothing will happen. My brothers, my sister, is not a small matter. It's not a small shoot bed, mama fly you. <laughs> hey, when I heard this matter, I said, Oni, you have entered. Oni, you have entered one chance, two chance, three chance, four chance. The chance you have entered, even you, you don't know. My brothers, my sister, so. At this point, I don't know if you should feel sorry for Oni. Because if you look at it very, very well, these women, they mean business. They did not even come to play. As a matter of fact, eh, as she is doing whatever she is doing, or she say she's not even looking at Kabi Esif's face. So. Ashley, that thing that she says she wants to do in her mind, she will do it. Because she feels she and the Kabi Esif, they have the same power. They have the same right. They have the same authority. That is what she always feel. Like, yes, Kabi Esif is from a ruling house. Me too, I'm from a ruling house. So Ashley, why didn't you marry yourself? If you are from a ruling house and Kabi Esi is from a ruling house, you should have married yourself. Let everybody rest on a kum kum. Always looking for a way for Oni to get angry so that they will say, Oh, Oni, I've gotten angry. Oh, Oni, I've done this one. But guess what? Oni will not get angry. Oni is a man of his words. And Oni will continue to keep his words. But actually, they your lane. That's on period. My brothers, my sisters, oh, this is all I had. I said I should come and let you guys know what's happening on social media streets. See you guys later. Now, do where to subscribe, like, comment, and bye for now.